Hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello there. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good to see Hi. you guys. How I'm was very it? Good to see you too. Oh, yeah. I, I, I have that on time. Okay, good. So that's uh, very good for you to be here, even though you, uh, you're not feeling good. So thank you. Thank you very much. We really appreciate that. Okay, people are coming. So I was uh, two minutes behind. Sorry. Okay, so. Are you ready? Yes, teacher. Okay, we'll just. Yes, we are. Start yes, again. mister. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, Noe. The important thing is that you are here. Okay, please remember to help me with the cameras, okay? So it's important that I see you, that you see me. Um, not that John, but I'm here, so. I seem very important. Thank you very much. Uh, 14, uh, well, 13 students so far. I hope that everybody get in line. Okay, so we're going to finish with the things that we started yesterday. And uh, let me... And what is the topic, guys? It's been a long time. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. Information about someone's past, uh, recent past events. Okay, so information, past, uh, recent and past events. Okay, good. So today is Friday. What, what day is today, by the way? Is there November? Uh huh. November third, and the year twenty twenty three. Two thousand twenty three. Okay, two thousand twenty three. So remember that yesterday we were talking about success stories, right? And we were talking a little bit, a bit about these guys, uh, yeah. Oprah Winfrey and uh, uh, Bill Gates. Okay, and uh, do you do you know any other success stories? Do you know any others? For example, um, Mark Zuckerberg. Ah, uh, Mark Zuckerberg. Yeah, Mark Zuckerberg is a uh, a made made of. Uh -huh. Yes, I know. Yes. Made of the the Facebook. Uh -huh. He's the one that created uh, Facebook, good. Okay, and that's, that's his, um, uh, what will be? That is his, his personal, educa personal information, education, or accomplishment. Uh-huh. What? Uh, sorry, I don't listen good. It's, uh, he created uh, Facebook. It's a uh, what? Personal information, education, or accomplishment? Uh, I think accomplishment. It's a it's it's one of his accomplishments. Yes. Okay. So there are many many. If we start talking about success life, so the uh, success stories there are uh, many over there, right? So Mark Zuckerberg is one. And uh, then we can talk about the jobs. Like, it, it, even there are some some people like Gandhi that he. What was Gandhi's accomplishment? For example, it was uh, it was about technological or political accomplishment. I think is a uh, religious. A religious, even though religious political, okay? Yeah, but it was a religious accomplishment to set up a peace in Africa with no, or uh, with no, if I'm not mistaken, Africa, uh, with no violence. Tibet. 
Uh -huh, exactly. There are many accomplishments. Okay, so we were saying that uh, that page 72 exercise 2 conversation part A listen and practice how did you get into modeling Stacy well when I graduated from drama school I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actress I was going to auditions every day but I never got any parts and I was running out of money so what did you do I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, what is the conversation about Don Luis Alfredo? Um, in your own words. Yes. Um... Uh, they, uh, they are speak of the experience of mm -hmm. your life. Uh, Stacy, uh, the later uh, a time, a far a time, and she is an actress. Ah, okay. She is okay. She's an actress. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, Don Luis. And, okay. And uh, uh, Jennifer. Mouset. What else? Casi Any... no le escucho. Hola. Uh, hola. We we hear you very well. So, uh, what else can you add to about Stacy? Don Luis says that uh, he was a uh, uh, Madeline. He got a job. And what else? Mm. I don't know. Okay, no worry, don't worry. It's okay. Maria Jose, is there something else? Um she's she's work um sorry, um she's work at model. She's working okay, so it's a model. It's a model, sorry, it's a model. Uh huh. And his first job um was in a restaurant. Mm -hmm. And she's a model uh, okay. full time. Okay, thank you very much, Maria Jose. I think you gave a lot of information as well to other people. Uh, Don Juan Antonio, what would be your lucky break? What would be your uh, success story or your accomplishment? General, in general. Um, let me see. Mm -hmm. um, uh, let me see, let me see. Well, I remember only that uh, she wanna uh, doing an, an actress. Um, ah, okay. Okay, uh, don't And right now. Uh -huh, tell me, yeah? right? And right now? And right now she work uh, about the... Uh, uh, she's doing uh, uh, modeling. Okay, she's doing modeling. Okay. Modeling, uh -huh, right. Thank you, Don Antonio. But my question Do was this. Who can share with us about your... your um, your accomplishment. What what it will be your success story? Accomplishment by you. For example, my my accomplishment is to become a teacher. My family is my accomplishment. My two kids, okay? There are those are my companies. I raised a family, I graduated as a teacher, and I work as an English teacher. So those are my success stories. So, yes, Arai? I have a question. Okay. Accomplishments uh, uh, is like motivation. Uh -huh. or kind of, uh. Tell me, tell me, Sara. Tell us, Arai. You know, uh, um, my question was accomplishment is like synonym, synonym of motivation or something like that. No, accomplishment is 
uh, a compliment is what you have made up of your life. What is on, uh, sorry, my Spanglish, su logros. Like the goals. Mm -hmm. So that is accomplishment, okay? For example, my accomplishment is, one of my accomplishments is that I, I graduated from the university. I am an English teacher. I work as an English teacher. So that's my accomplishment. My family also is my accomplishment, okay? So because I raised a family and that's accomplishment. Mm -hmm. Okay, who would like to share about your accomplishment, about your story, uh, your life story in general? Uh huh. Don Edgar, Mauricio? Yeah, my accomplishment is to speak English and very good. And in that way, is to get a job where I can earn. A lot of money. Okay, good, excellent. That's your one of your greatest accomplishment that you speak English very well and that led you to have a better job, you know? Uh, no English, no informatica, uh, let's say $300. With English, $500, uh, $600, $600. With, uh, good skills with informatica nowadays a thousand dollars so you see how to increase so good excellent who else would like to share your accomplishment uh, verbally or on the or on the chat write it on the chat please uh -huh, don vicente meanwhile my accomplishment uh -huh. my accomplishment is uh, when i get my when i got my house when I uh, got my son okay. and um, um, when I got my job, actually yeah. my job, yeah. that, that was some of my accomplishment. So exactly, you bought, you bought a house, so it's one of your- Your retirement, my friend. Ah, yeah. <laughs> the retirement, okay. it's one of your accomplishments at the end. Yeah, of the please. <laughs> okay. I want to retire. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, ladies. Ladies, who would like to share one of your accomplishments? A couple of your accomplishments in general. Okay, I try. Yes, go ahead. Um. Uh, for me, uh, my information accomplishment is I uh, get started uh, speak English for my sister okay. because she's is there in U.S. Uh, okay. um, I am in El Salvador. Um, I think uh, to travel the uh, U.S. and a good idea to speak uh, better, but it's more and more important to speak English in, in, in there. Um, in this moment, I have, I think I could, I, I talked about, um, 50%, I don't know. I okay. think I think it's more important to try better, better for me. Okay, good, good. Uh, let me tell you that I, um, uh, so far that I know, but I, your English is very good, by, by the way, uh, Brenda, it's, it's good. And I'm sure it will increase and improve a lot, okay? Uh, talking about increase or improve a lot your English, please take an advance of the audios that I send you. Have you been practicing with the audios? Uh, yes, I yeah. uh, number track one and track two uh, in practice. Okay. And um, in my time, free time, mm -hmm. I have an app uh, when I you practice in my vocabulary. Um, the writing not, but um, okay. practice the, the talks about. Y yes, mm -hmm. I, I hope that everybody's uh, using the audios in order to practice repetition. Rem remember, even that you just repeating is helping you to develop the, the your tone, your, your voice, and your listening. 
because when you talk, you listen to yourself. Okay, we did yesterday this one, thank you. And I will send you uh, some other different. So we did this one yesterday, I guess we were here. Get into, what is get into? This is from the vocabulary, from the conversation. What is get, get into? To? Como comenzar algo? To, to start, yes, to start, to begin something, okay? You can say to start, to begin something, that's, that's good, okay? So, and the other is, what is it? Drama. Drama school. And, and what is a drama school? Where is doing to study acting? Okay, where students go to study acting, right? Uh, and um, auditions. Uh huh. What is auditions, Wendy, Lisette? Short performance by actors that are used in order to decide if they should act in a play, movie, or TV show. Or TV show. Okay, so people who listen. The only is running out of money. I got paid in a couple of days back, but I'm running out of money. What does means? Uh, what it what is what it what it means? Uh, uh, Cecilio, running out of money. Using all using all of your money mm -hmm. so that so so that there is almost none, no no one left. None left. Okay, good, excellent. Thank you, Cecilia. Using all your money so that there is there is almost none there is almost. left. None left. That when you say almost none left, casi nada, okay? So, and the other is lucky break. What is a lucky break? Uh, for example, when I you win the lottery. Yeah, <laughs> you win the lottery, that, that's, that's a lucky break. Uh, so, yes, a chance to do something that improves your, your also, it means a chance uh, to do something that improves your life, okay? So, um, for example, me, I, I feel lucky. I, I feel that working with you guys, that's my lucky break because I didn't think about it, but uh, it came to me. So I'm very happy working with you, okay? And, um, and I hope can, okay, so get into, Everybody repeat, get into, get into, into drama, get into. School, drama school, drama school, drama school, auditions, auditions, auditions. running out of, of money, running out running, of money, running out of money, lucky break, lucky break, lucky break. Okay, remember that here, this one, this one here this is not off off turn the lights off uh, the switch that's a o f f this is of uh, of of uh, of uh, uh, of, uh your, um, lip, your upper teeth goes to on um, like 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 something like this running out of money okay I'm making an effort here because I'm teaching, but I, when I talk, there is no need for me to make a big effort. So I just said, oh, I'm running out of money. Okay. Uh, no Mr. Escucha. Is is on shop? What? Ava. Of? What, no. do you, what do you mean, son? What was the question? Uh, que si el sonido del off es como un sonido schwa. Uh, something like that. It's, uh, okay, because it's like, like, for example, the C and the Z, 
uh, we don't uh, the Z. And this one we say of, uh, of. You see my lips? Of, okay. You say more or less. Uh, I don't know if I answered your question, but it's, it's, it's not off. Off is cuando apaga la, la cosa, candela. Okay. Okay, I got it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Well, okay. Ow, I, ow. Yeah. Okay. The grammar, the conversation introduces, creo que aquí nos quedamos, right? We were here. Um. Uh, the conversation, yes. the conversation introduces uh, what? Uh huh. What does the conversation? Past continue versus simple past. Past continue versus simple past. Okay, let's listen. Page seventy-three, exercise three, grammar focus. Past continuous versus simple past. Past continuous for an action in progress in the past. I was going to auditions every day. Simple past for a completed action. But I never got any parts. I was going to auditions every day, but I never got any parts. I was running out of money when I got a job as a waitress. While I was working at the restaurant, a customer offered me a job as a model. Okay, we are Page using 70. Uh, we are using we are using the the past continue versus simple past. Okay. So what is the past continue? Uh, what is the past continue? Uh huh. What is the past continue? Let's see. Nia Lorena Menjivar, could you read? Use past continues. Uh, you said to say someone was in the middle. Uh -huh. Middle. Doing of doing something at certain time. A certain time, yes. Used to say someone was in the middle of doing something at a certain time. For example, uh, Nia Lorena, read the example that you have over there. Take this. Mm -hmm. example, my family was watching TV at this time last night. My family was watching TV at this time uh, last night. Okay, I was teaching English, but my family wa uh, my family was watching TV. Okay, so that's I they were in the middle of something in the past. And uh, uh, let's see who else. Uh, Sarai Trejos. Sarah Trejos. Yes. Uh -huh. Could you read often use? Often use together with the simple past. Often use uh, together with the simple past. Don Edgar Mauricio. Examples. Uh, I was eating when the phone rang. I was eating with the phone ran. Another, Don Mauricio. I can see. Ah, uh, who can see it? Are you started? I start to rain. Uh -huh. I start to rain while I was waiting for the bus. It started to rain while I I was waiting for the bus. For example, on, on this sentence, um, uh, my family was watching TV when I taught English, okay? An English class. Or I can use both also. So this is often used together with the simple past, okay? So we're using, if you like to take notes over there or that one,
So for example, um, I was I was an uh, 30 minutes ago, I was teaching English and some kids uh, and some kids started running outside. I can say, in what words do I use when uh, when I use the, the simple past and the and the and the past continuous together? I use what? Time. Uh huh. I use. But what are the words? When. When and. While. While. And while. They they are in, in interchangeable, so I can say I uh, I was eating while the phone ran. I uh, no, I'm sorry. The phone ran while I was eating. Okay. In simple past. In the simple past, I can start uh, the simple past. Uh, for example, the phone ran while I was eating. For example, on the on the on the second example, we started with the second with the simple pass. So it started to rain while I was waiting for the bus. In the primer ejemplo, on the first example, we start with the past continuum. I was sitting when the phone ran. I was teaching English when the kids started yelling outside. I was teaching English when my my cat, my kitten, came into the room. Okay, let's see some some other examples. For example, what it says over there. This simple is some, uh -huh, simple past versus. Past continuous. Past continuous. A ver, ¿qué me falta aquí? It, Oscar Alexander. Okay. Are you there? No, Ezequiel. Oh, Oscar, Oscar. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Uh, Oscar, could you please read this one? Simple pass. Uh, I went to the cinema yesterday. Uh -huh. yes? yes. I always visited my grandparents uh -huh. in my summer holiday holidays when I was little. Okay. And the other? I lived near Liverpool for a couple of years. A year. So we use the simple past to talk about what? Complete actions, habits, or facts in the past. I live in Chalatenango when I was a kid. I moved to San Salvador in 1985, for example. So I started, I started teaching English in 1993, more or less, okay? So that's a simple past, an action that uh, uh, completed in the past. And what is the, uh, Lorena Araceli, what, uh, what is past continuous? Nialore, Araceli. Are you there? Elizabeth Medrano, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, could you read the past continuous, uh, Miss? Okay, the past continuous is used to express uh -huh. Interrupted actions, a specific time as an inter interruption, and parallel actions. Okay. I read the examples. I was watching TV when the phone rang. 
That's uh -huh. the other last night. Last night at seven p.m. I was having dinner. Yes. Okay. While while she was doing her homework, her brother was playing football. He was playing football. So we use the usually usually we use the past continuum uh, along with the with the simple past. But there are some we use the words. What are the words that we use in order to use both? Porque no lo podemos when, usar sin esto. When and while. And while. So, for example, say, when I was working at the restaurant, says uh, the lady, a customer offered me a job as a model. Or we can say, we can say, uh huh. While I was working at the restaurant? Yes. A customer? A customer offered me a job as model. Okay. While, um, when, and while can be in interchangeable. Okay. So we can change it. And when, and you know that it will be cuando, and while it is uh, mientras. So let's see at the conversation. Uh, let's go back uh, a little bit quickly to the conversation. No, no. Uh, okay. Okay, what are the, ex let me, let me take that one. Okay, look at the conversation and what are, what are the sentences where they use past continuous and simple past or simple past and past continue? Uh-huh. Uh, for example, when I graduated from drama school. Yes, that's one. Okay. What is another one? That is that is a past continue or simple simple past? A simple past. That is a simple past. And the other example? And I was going to audition every day. Yeah, I was going to auditions every day. Okay, that's another one. Um, I was running out of money. I was running, but if you notice over there, they are using the uh, she's using Stacy's using only the simple past or the past continue, not together. But the sentence and the conversation goes very good for her. On the second part, when what are the sentences or what is the sentence where she is using both at the same time? While I was working. Ah, yes. While I was working, what is the other sentence? The other part of the sentence. I was I was modeling full okay. time. Uh -huh. While I was working, a customer offered me a job. Uh -huh. That's one sentence, okay? And while one, as a mother, is, so in that case, she's using both, okay? Can she say, over mm -hmm. there it says, while I was working there, a customer offered me, uh, offered me some work as a model. Can she start with the simple pre, uh, with the simple pass? Puede ella comenzar con la segunda oración? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. And what will yes. be the sentence? Uh, give me give me one one minute. Okay. Okay. What will be the sentence? I was modeling. Yeah, uh -huh, but uh, she's going to start with the simple past. Uh huh. She's starting with the simple past. I'm sorry. <laughs> I forgot to go. Uh, uh huh. 
What would be the sentence if she start with the simple past? When I graduated. Uh -huh. Ah, when I, okay. So, okay, when I graduated from drama school, what sería? He moved to Los Angeles to look for work okay. as an actress. Okay, that one possibility. Or she can say, when I graduated from drama school, I was working at a restaurant. On this one, this one over here, she can say, a customer offered me a job so, uh, offer me some work as a model while I was working in a restaurant. In a restaurant. There is in a restaurant. In a restaurant. So, yes. so the sentence will not be changed. She can say, while I was working in a restaurant, a customer offered me a job. Or she can say, a customer offered me a job while I was working in a restaurant. And very good sentence. Okay. So I hope that I, let's uh, let's do the practice in order not to confundilos. Okay, let's see. Here we got. Okay, and this is uh, so. For example, that's you can say uh, while I was working at a restaurant, a customer offered me a job, or she can say a customer offered me a job as a model while I was working at a restaurant. Either way, okay. There, you have it, this one over there. Uh, we have how much time? Okay. I will send you in a breakout room for about um, eight minutes, okay? In group of three. How many are we in right now? 19, 18. Let's see. Uh, my God, my... My, uh, how many breakout rooms? So we are uh, seven, 17. Um, let's say 17 and this is what? Six, okay, five. I will send one or more. So I will give you like, like about uh, 10 minutes or maybe less, okay, um, no, about seven minutes, and try to do the exercises over there. Okay, just let me stop here. I will make five. Oops. <laughs> Okay, so now you will be in four. Please do the exercise. Are you listening a mano, right? Yes. Okay, good. Okay. You should be receiving the invitation right now. Good, so now you are accepting the invitation. Lick, buenas noches, para que bueno. pudieran ver nuevamente que sin querer le di cancelar en vez de un y me por. Ah, uh, ok. Gracias. Eh, eh, your name is? Norma. Norma. Ok, let me see. Eh, ya la voy a asignar. Ajá, Norma. Ok, la voy a mover a otra. Y a don Vicente también, porque solo él está. 
Me uh, too, teacher. Ok. Y a don Vicente también, porque solo él está. A sala 3. And you are don Mauricio, right? Me see. Don Noé. I... Voy a asignar a la dos. Le reasigno a Don Edgar. Sala dos. Lo reasigné, don a Edgar Mauricio. que está que lado. iba en en, gra, en, en, en el gra, en el lado opuesto Dote Abins. Dote. Ah, in, in, in... I was no I was live living I was living I was I was oh, living I guess I was living uh -huh, I was I was living with my grandparents. Living uh -huh, when, with when my grandparents I, when I entered. Enter, uh, entered the, the high school. When I entered the summer war. Entered at the high school. Enter. Uh -huh, I guess entered Edie. In, in, inter. Uh -huh, pasado. Entered. No, ED. Uh -huh, entered. I entered uh, to high school. To high school. <clears throat> high school is, is bachillerato. Bachillerato. Okay. I I was maker. I was maker. I was I was making last night. I was making. I was making. I was making. Making dinner last night. When the phone. When the phone. When the phone ran. Dinner rank. last night when the phone rang. Rang. Uh, rang. Rang. Mm -hmm. Rang. This, this is correct. Rang, I guess it's correct. Let me check. Okay. The number four. And so, so the number four, I see an Eric. Um, we're working. Excuse me. We're working porque se está hablando de dos personas. We're working. Tracy uh, and Eric. We're working. Yes, we're working in a restaurant in Vancouver, Canada. When they. When they. When they meet, met, met, el pasado, met. Um, when they met. They met. Okay, everybody should be coming. 
back. Where was everybody in um in the was everybody in the in the breakout rooms? Everybody should be coming back. Okay, let me just look for your attendance list. Meanwhile, the rest of the people come. Okay, everybody's here. Yeah, people are coming back because the time is over. Okay, were you discussing the the exercise over there? Yes, we were working. Yeah. Yes, teacher. I, yeah, I saw so now you working. Good, excellent. Okay, remember to always try to speak English, but uh, you were doing a great job. Thank you. Okay, so. Uh, the first one is I was driving and in England. Uh -huh, I was driving I I, in England when I suddenly, suddenly when I realized realized when I suddenly realized okay I was right I don't know what to, ah, I used it twice okay and then what is number two I was living. I was living. When? With my grandparents when I... Through. And when I in, entered. entered. Yeah. Entered and when I, to high school. Entered uh, the high school. And yeah. number three? Uh, I was making. I was making dinner last night when the phone... Ran. Ran. Run. Um, this is a very popular example on, on the exercises. Tracy and Eric. We're working. We're working. We're working. Yes, because it's talking about two people. That's why it said we're working in a restaurant in Vancouver when they met. When they met. Met. Okay. When met. they met. Okay. Irregular. Several years ago. I had. I I said I was having I was having yes I was having problems with math so I I was I had I had to find a tutor to find a tutor, a tutor. and we what we is, are living we were living yes in mm -hmm. a tiny apartment you know what the meaning of tiny. Tiny. Uh-huh. 
small, yeah. I guess. Very small. Yeah. Very, very, very small. Very small. Uh, less, Le very small. Little room. Yeah, like an studio, like a, but really it's very, small. very, very small. And um, um, my sofa is here and my TV is here. So I had to, okay. And uh, when uh, in a tiny apartment, when our first child Being born. was born, huh? Was born? Was born, yes. When my first, uh, the first child was born. Number mm -hmm. seven, my brother, I. Kate, my brother, was ice skating. Was was ice skating when he when he broke his when arm. He broke. And the last one, I was watching TV mm -hmm. when the when power the... went out. Went out. Okay. Uh, if a uh, if eh, todas las luces se van en gran parte de la ciudad, that's called blackout, okay? So that's called blackout. Eh, en la mayor parte de la ciudad, let's go. Oh, there was a blackout last night. Okay. In this, in this case, is power blackout. No, no, in this case, it's went out because it's only ah, well, a little part of the city. But I'm just uh, okay. telling you if uh, se va en la mayor parte de la ciudad, so that was that's called blackout. Uh -huh, but mm -hmm. in this case, uh, went out maybe in this part. So, for example, and the next, uh, the next exercise. Let me see what I what else I'm missing because I will. Uh, Okay. Uh, there you have some sentences on part eight. What it will be a good sentence? During my childhood, what would you say during your childhood, uh, Wendy? O Don Luis, O Don Vicente. Was playing. Okay. During my childhood, I was playing what? Was playing. Okay. What else, Don Luis? What would you say? Uh, say I yes, I play soccer in the street. Okay. Yes. During my childhood, I played yes. soccer on the streets. Good. Many of us did that. Yeah? Con pelotas yes. de trapo. No soy, tan, yes. no soy tan tan anciano, eh? <laughs> but uh, we start playing with pelota de trapo. Okay, um, okay, Wendy, what would you say? Either teacher. Uh -huh. What would you say during my childhood? During my childhood, I during my neighborhood. Okay, so for example, me, I say over there. Uh, let's see, let me see someone else. Uh, what would you say, uh, Edgar Mauricio, during your childhood? Uh, I have a question. I can use during my childhood. I used to play. Uh, how do you say? Uh, canica, marbles. Uh, uh, marbles. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You can say I used to play uh, yeah like that's uh, that you're referring but you or you can say during my childhood i played marbles with my friends okay mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh -huh. eugenio what would you say during your childhood i used to run rain no run i used uh -huh. to run for everywhere okay so you you <laughs> ran okay <laughs> Yeah, so the matter of the curves. You can say you can say I used to, but that's something like a habit. Used to uh, something that you did in the past, but are not anymore. Of course, for example, me, uh, I used to play high and seek. I used to play soccer. Not anymore. But uh, I can say during my childhood, I played soccer. I played high and seek. Uh huh. Oh, la don Maria Jose, what, what would you say? I met my best friend while 
I met my best friend while I was drinking coffee. Okay, good. I was uh, while I was drinking coffee at the cafeteria. Good, excellent. And uh, Don Juan Antonio, what would you say? I met my best friend while what? Well, I uh, met my best friend while um, I study uh, elementary school. Okay, while I was studying in elementary school. Good. And uh, let's say, uh, Wendy Lisette. I met my best friend while in the high school. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, Sarai, when I was going to elementary school, oh, this is my sentence, okay? Uh, I met my best friend while I was studying in high school. <laughs> okay, I had to use the, the ING over there, but I can use that one also. It's, it was Sarai, right? When I was going to elementary school, what would you say? Elementary is from first grade to sixth grade. And uh, not to, uh, yes, to sixth grade. Okay. Uh huh. Volunteer? Uh, yes, Don Vicente. When I was uh, going to elementary school, I was living in Suchitoto. Ah, yeah, you were living in Suchitoto. Yes. When I was going to elementary school, I was living in Chalatenango. Me. Ah? By, by Nueva Concepción, we had to walk four kilometers every day to get to school, four kilometers to school, and four kilometers to back to Come home. Back. Yes, we had to walk a lot. Okay, so for example, the two examples that I we, Don Vicente and I used, when I was going to elementary school, I was living in Chalatenango. Is it okay, can I use the, uh, the past continuous in both sentences? Can I? Can I use yeah. the past? Yes, it sounds perfect. When I was going to elementary school, I was living in Chalatenango. And yes. I can if I I can use the simple past. And I walked four kilometers. Okay. When I was going to elementary school, I was living in Chalatenango and I walked four kilometers every day. Uh -huh. Actually, it was eight kilometers because uh, four uh, to schools, four to school. So my sentence over there is, I hope that you play your sentence. And I play football uh, with my friends. Okay. Two years ago, Lorena Menjivar, what would you say two years ago? Uh, two years ago, I'm married. Ah, I was getting married. Or you can say, I married. Good, excellent. I yeah, I got congratulations. Married. Congratulations on that, Lorena. Okay, good. So you can say, two years ago, I was getting married. Or I two years ago, I married. Good, excellent. Okay, so last year, this is my sentence. My son came to visit us. Well, not me, just my wife also. So two years ago, my son came to visit me. Last year, in order to finish, what would you say? Last year, I was little more young. Uh, okay, <laughs> I was getting, I was, mm, I was getting married, a uh, young woman. Good. Okay. Okay, guys. So I hope that please uh, trabajan en la plataforma. No se les olvide. Are you using the audios to practice? Are you using the audios? 
No, because I I'm not in the WhatsApp group. Okay, I, I will tell. So please, if you got the audios, please use it, practice, okay? Let me take the attendance. Okay. Okay, please, before we go. Uh, Ana Sonia Elizabeth Martinez. Present teacher. Andrea Esther Costa Hernandez. Andrea. Bre Brenda, Brenda Claribel Mejia Segovia. I'm here present. Cecilio Antonio Cortez Escobar. Present. Claudia Maria Gómez Canizales. Claudia Edgar Mauricio Barrera Ortega. Present teacher. Eugenio Ernesto Martínez Fuentes. Present, mister. Eh, Giovanni Josué González Olmedo. Stephanie Nauset Arevalo Flores. Jennifer, girl. Uh, okay, Jennifer. Present. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, Juan Antonio Brande Paz. Present teacher. Catherine Mariel Vázquez Flores. Laura Concepción Mena Garay. Present teacher. Lorena Araceli Hernández de García. Lorena de Los Ángeles Mengíbar de Najarro. I'm here, teacher. Yeah, uh, Luis Alfredo Aguilar Beltrán. Present teacher. María José Najarro Mengíbar. Present teacher. Noé Ezequiel Rivera Medrano. Present teacher. Eh, Norma Lisset Crespín Orellana. Present teacher. Oscar Alexander Domínguez Herrera. I'm here, teacher. Saraí Noemi Trejo Suyoa. Eh, Sara okay, Saraí. I guess you're there, right? Eh, Vicente Israel Sánchez Serazo. Present, teacher. And Wendy Lisset Carías de Cedillos. Present, teacher. Okay, guys, thank you very much. I'll see you on Monday. Have a nice weekend. See I see you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Bye. See you Monday. You're welcome. My pleasure. See you.